projects, I try to make a, a plan that covers several, several aspects of the production. And for this particular contest, I'll be working on a lathe that I'm not familiar with. And though it is a lathe contest, I need a plan that doesn't solely rely on a familiar lathe. Okay, so I'm making something that's components and goes together cold, and so what can go together cold? And I, I decided on this this moving functional piece, and, and with moving parts, I need someone else who's uh, mechanically minded. And so my friend Stuki, who's been making all these remote control cars with uh, moving suspension and the whole frame is of glass. He is the guy to help me figure out the problems and the mechanics in this moving piece. I go by Stuky. Every single time I see him, it's something new, something different. He's always trying to expand off of what he does. It's a big honor to be asked by him to be a part of his project. These shows are so much fun. I just have a blast. Uh, one of the biggest things to me personally is this entire industry is spread across the, the country and I have so many close friends in this industry who I rarely get to see except at these shows. And so the sense of community when everyone comes together at one of these locations is really great. You know, there's a thrill in performing for the public out of your comfort zone, uh, forced to perform regardless of conditions. Uh, I really enjoy putting myself out like that. Well, I've done comp contests in all different levels of practice state. I've done contests with zero practice, or I've done contests where I I feel thoroughly practiced. I, I never try to make my common work, or I try never to make my common work at these contests, because I, I, I enjoy the thrill of being out of my comfort zone and executing something difficult and never before done. Um, so I, some people need their practice to feel comfortable, and I enjoy it the most with less practice and just a well thought out plan.